Welcome back to the program. Let me ask you about Venezuela's relations with the United States of America. They are very bad. We've heard many, many attacks by President Hugo Chavez on the American presidents and lots of attacks verbally back and forth. But you have now nominated one of your most able and trusted diplomats to be your next ambassador to the United States. Are you looking to move forward in this relationship, to change this relationship? I do not agree with the first part of your question. Our relations with the U.S. are very good. <laughs> Very good. Our relations with the workers, with the trade unions, with the artists, with intellectuals, with the social movements. All right, with the, the government of the United States. Very good. With the government, of the U.S. government, it is well known. In declassified uh, Pentagon uh, papers of the CIA, the State Department, WikiLeaks, and so on and so forth, and Snowden's paper, there's sufficient evidence of U.S. agencies, of how you have constantly conspired to put an end to this revolution, to destroy President Chavez. We want to have a new type of relations based on respect. Equality among states and the recognition of what we are today. Do you really believe they want to reconquer Latin America? Of course, of course I do. They want, first of all, the, the economic control. They have the political control through political classes and elites that govern some of our countries. And they want to have the military control because, regrettably, the U.S. elite, they have a project tied to establish the hegemony and the control. And in the world of today, it is impossible. Do, do you have a message for the U.S.? There's been expelling of diplomats. You did it. They did it. Now you've nominated Mr. Max Arbelez as your new ambassador to Washington. What do you hope to see? What is your message to the United States? Well, my message is respect dialogue, that we overcome the visions they have of our country. Precisely, I made a decision to appoint a new ambassador to the U.S., a man that I trust, great uh, diplomat that knows the world, knows very well the U.S., and I'm certain that he will be very helpful to establish new levels of relations. Don't go to a stalemate, to a blind alley regarding Venezuela and Latin America. Our message to the, the, those ruling the U.S. is respect Venezuela, respect Latin America, and let's establish new levels of relations.